So your idea of a weight loss meal might mean plain fish or chicken with a simple salad pouring, but you might be forgetting a key ingredient, spices. Are to, they're known to help speed up your metabolism, but which one should we use? That's really the question. So here to tell us more is fitness expert Heather Wilson Phillips. Good to see you. Thank you so much. I know because you know when when I think about uh, trying to burn some fat off yes. uh, when we're talking about food, I do feel like I need to go quite boring. But you're saying the opposite is true. Absolutely. So I have clients asking me all the time, what are some of the spices that they can use to help when they're cooking? Mm. And so what I've done today is I have about five different spices that we can kind of go through that'll help you with your cooking and help you burn more calories. And these are spices that are not unusual. No, we all have them, or we should have them in our kitchen. If we don't, they're very accessible. Okay, so where do we start here? So the first spice we have today is cinnamon. So cinnamon can actually help um, speed up our metabolism. So it actually um, stabilizes our blood sugar levels. Mm. So by adding more cinnamon to our diet, it can block the excess fat. It helps us to feel full longer, and it prevents us from overeating. For example, and we're, we're looking here at yes. So we have very good. That's, yeah, this is apple cinnamon oatmeal. And so this is one of the ways that we can incorporate cinnamon into our diet by adding it to oatmeal or to our shakes or to our fruit. Okay, that's a good option. Okay, moving on, little little kick. Yes, we have cayenne. So cayenne spice has a lot of heat to it. And so the active ingredient in cayenne is capsaicin. And so what capsaicin does, it actually raises your body's overall temperature. Mm -hmm. And when this happens, it helps to speed up your metabolism once again and allows you to burn more calories. To sweat it out. To sweat it out, exactly. <laughs> and it can allow you to burn more calories and lose weight. Yeah, and your, one of your suggestions here would be a chili. Yes, this is a ground turkey chili, and this is one of the ways I love to incorporate cayenne because it just adds a bit of kicky t kick to the to the chili. I like the kicky. The kicky. Add some kicky. I'm a kicky, yeah. Right, to the I'm going to incorporate that, the kicky, into my life. Uh, I will. I want to ask you also about, because you see a lot of people when they're trying to lose weight, they'll yeah. have like a glass of water or something with lemon and cayenne. And cayenne. Is that something you'd recommend or not? Absolutely. Yeah? Yes, you can yeah. definitely, any of these spices, you can drink them. They all are available in a tea bag form as well, too. Mm. Okay, so good right. suggestion. All right, moving on. What's next? So this is cumin. So there's been a lot. Okay, and the question, sorry, I have to okay, do yeah. downstairs. Is it cumin or cumin? So it's pronounced so many different ways. <laughs> cumin, I've heard cumin, I've heard... I know. It's one, of the, it's, it's one of those spices. Whatever what do you say? I say cumin. Okay. What do you say? I think I, now, I, now I don't know. <laughs> I can't remember. <laughs> it's like a word you say too much. You just now say it and it's, yeah, it's yeah. It'll come back to me. Okay. I think I say... I don't know. Okay. <laughs> okay. Cumin. So cumin, um, so researchers are showing that by consuming cumin, you can burn up to three times more fat, which is absolutely, really? three times, I know, which is absolutely amazing. So aside from burning up to three times more fat, it helps with bloating and it helps with detox in your body. It's absolutely amazing. And when we say burning more fat, is this one of those things that we eat this and then we have to work out right after kind of thing or work out before and then eat this? Like what is the, what's the process? So you can, if you're one adding it, if you want to add it to your food before you have have it um, before you go to the gym. Mm -hmm. You can have it. You can have it after. Any food, doesn't matter. It doesn't. It really okay. doesn't matter. It's going to help you for the entire day. As long as it's in your system. As long as it's in your system. Okay. Yeah. How do we get this in our system? What so is this is turmeric, and so absolutely love turmeric. And turmeric has some thermogenic properties in it, and so you might not feel the heat from it, but it actually helps you to burn more calories, speeds up your metabolism, helps with inflammation and digestion issues. Okay, this is the only one I was saying of the five. This is the only one I don't have. Okay. But I can get yes, it. Yes, you can get it. And it's found in curry powders as well, too. Yes, so, so good, curry. which I love. Okay, I so love awesome. Curry, yeah. Yes. Yeah, okay. So we have our garlic shrimp and brown rice here, um, the turmeric. Oh, it's amazing. Amazing. Mm -hmm. Okay, and finally, what are we looking at? So we have ginger. And I absolutely mm -hmm. love ginger. And the benefits of ginger, you're getting the best of both worlds. You're helping speed up your metabolism and stabilizing your blood sugar levels at the same time. So it's really a win-win spice. And what a great way to prepare it, too, in a stir, stir fry. fry. is oh, so, so good. good. Yes. And all that color and all the vegetables. Love it. Yeah. These are great ideas. Yes, I've learned awesome. so much, and I need to get that. I know turmeric. Yeah. And uh, cumin. Cumin. Uh, or cumin. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Okay, if you're looking for more information, Heather, thanks so much. Thank you can you. always head to our website at yourmorning.ca.